Um, hello, my name is Dina Khlat. Um, I'm a part-time instructor at the American University of Technology in Lebanon. Uh, a brief introduction about myself. Um, I, have, I was born in Lebanon. Uh, when I was very young, I moved to Saudi Arabia, where I lived there for 10 years with my family. Uh, from there, we went on to live in England for another 10 years. And there, I graduated from the University of Surrey. Uh, and I graduated, I had a, a hospitality management degree. Um, in 1994, we moved back to uh, Lebanon, where I started my hospitality career, and I worked in leading uh, hospitality establishments and senior management positions um, uh, in Lebanon and in Qatar. Uh, in 2010, when I returned from Qatar, I decided to open my own consultancy firm, which is based around the hospitality industry. Uh, Teaching has always been a passion of mine, and therefore in 2015, um, I started teaching at the American University of Technology. All, all my courses are based around the hospitality industry. So this is a brief introduction about myself. Uh, why I am interested in COIL, uh, basically for me and for my students, this is something that is a new experience for both of us, for both my students and myself. Um, I want to uh, expose them to something new. I want them to go outside their comfort zone and experience an online teaching and learning techniques, especially in this digital age. Um, I want them to be exposed to different cultures and different uh, um, countries and cultures. And I want them to exchange ideas with other hospitality students that are, that are outside um, their area, outside the Middle East, maybe America, uh, South America, uh, Japan, um, anywhere that is different from their own cultures. Um, also, uh, for me, it's very important that they meet and they exchange ideas, uh, they understand their way of thinking and behaving, especially in the hospitality industries, which where eventually they will be exposed to so many different cultures, and I want them to experience this kind of uh, experience. Um, and for me, this will build their confidence, their social skills, their communication skills, that will help them deal with clients from different cultures and countries, and eventually maybe build new business relationships for the future. So this is why uh, the interest in COIL you know, came up for me as well. Um, what type of uh, course I'm thinking? I, I thought about a lot uh, about the type of course I want to teach with my partner. And basically, it's something around managing cultural diversity in the hospitality industry. Uh, we want to look at something related to um, the changing trends in this um, topic, uh, looking at overcoming uh, any challenges or the benefits that are related to cultural diversity and maybe what are the problems that can occur, uh, how can they become aware of it, understand it and eventually manage it. And this can be looked at from uh, the point of view of providing uh, good customer service or working and managing employees from other cultures especially because I worked in Qatar and there were so many different cultures. I found that to be very important to be able to work with other cultures and understand them, manage them eventually, and hopefully this will be reflected uh, with the students. Um, how I see it is perhaps with my teaching um, partner, we will create a topic around the subject that I've discussed now, and um, we will divide students into groups and uh, maybe um, let them uh, do a group project together related to this matter and then present it online uh, together and then exchange ideas and you know ask questions. It could be something like, I'm open to a lot of ideas, so hopefully uh, my teaching partner will have as well ideas that we can exchange and eventually give the students to, to do. Uh, the, the, the teacher that I'm, the partner that I'm looking for uh, should basically have uh, a background in hospitality, have worked, has worked in the hospitality industry and is teaching hospitality based courses because I think both of us with our students will mostly benefit uh, in this sense. Thank you. <laughs>